A Douglasville man waiting for a new kidney is also planning a wedding. It's just a few weeks away now. Now, we first told you about the couple's journey last weekend. And as Fox 5's Portia Bruner reports, that initial story compelled a Fox 5 viewer to make a very generous donation. So you look absolutely beautiful. There are lots of gorgeous wedding gowns inside Brides Atlanta in Douglas County. And they all look gorgeous on Rebecca Bridwell. But there's only one that brought this 25-year-old Douglasville bride-to-be to tears. That's the one. That speaks volume. That's the one. Uh huh. That that that's speaks volume. What makes this dress even more amazing? Rebecca doesn't have to pay for it, or the veil, or even the shoes she'll wear when she marries her sweetheart Thomas Smith on October 27th. Even Thomas's tuxedo is included in the deal. What does this mean for you and your fiance? Not to have to worry about that. It's just, you know, it's. It brings us closer to that day and just takes the stress off. You know, it's a huge load and it's more than we could ever imagine. Brides Atlanta owner Tiffany Stovall decided to make the donation after seeing Rebecca and Thomas's story on Fox 5 Saturday night. You see, in the midst of their wedding plans, Thomas, who has diabetes, is also trying to save up for costly medical bills as he awaits a new kidney and a new pancreas. My health is it's slowly decreasing, uh, you know, since December, they put me on dialysis. Stovall has watched her own brother, Shane, manage the emotional and financial challenges of diabetes, and that's what made the two of them want to help. But the gifts don't stop here. The siblings also own Atlanta West Jewelry, so they're going to fit Rebecca with a wedding band to match her engagement ring. And this is one day in your life that you'll always remember and you want to hold to your heart in any way that, that Shane and I both can help this couple. Um, we just feel like um, we, we, if you give a blessing, you'll get blessed. It's emotional. So I'm just so thankful for this day. From Douglas County, Portia Bruner, Fox 5 News. And the store owners say they hope that their businesses will uh, be able to help the couple offset some of those wedding costs.